Hi, this is May Borak from Trader. Welcome to my live trading session where I'm going to show you today how to predict a stock movement before it makes the move. Yes, I can do that. It all starts with S&P 500, which is down 1.2%. Take a look at the S&P, five minute candles. We are leaving bottoming tails. It looks like the S&P does not want to continue down. Therefore, I'm looking for a stock that will move up with the S&P. And I just found Tesla, which I'm gonna go long right over here 2,000 shares buying right now. Now Tesla is trending lower. Why should I go long? Because the S&P is moving up. Look at this fourth green candle that we're seeing right here. That's the candle that's going to take us out. And also remember, we have a very big gap to close. So we may move higher based on the fact that we're holding here. We're seeing some bottoming tails, some dodges at the lows. Look at Tesla, it started moving up, finally started moving up. I'm up $1,200. $1,400, $1,700, $1,900. It's moving up. It's not yet at my target, just over $2,000. I'm getting close to the point where I would like to take my partial. I'm going to sell 1,800 shares. It's moving up just over $3,000. Here we are getting ready for a partial, $3,600, a small pullback right now, took my partial, left just 200 shares. I don't really trust the market to continue much higher. It just did move over the highs. It's likely now to move up and close the gap. So I'm looking for another trade, but this time I would rather find a stock that is relatively strong. Look at MRK. MRK started with a very big gap down today, but it moved up before the market moved up. So it show, it's showing me that it has a lot of uh, strength compared to the market, compared to other stocks that I'm watching. So MRK just moved up and it has a beautiful, beautiful bull flag formation, which I would like to take an advantage. But you always buy before the breakout, which is approximately now, and I'm going to buy now, buying now 4,000 shares before the breakout. You have to predict the breakout. You do not buy at the breakout because if you try and buy at the breakout, you just probably going to lose the trade. Look at the breakout and look at how fast it happens. If you would have chased this one, I don't think you, you could have had it. So I'm selling here 3,600 shares, leaving 400 shares. That was a beautiful trade too. So you have to remember, it all starts with the S&P. The S&P just moved up and closed the gap. Also, one more thing to remember, when the S&P is closing the gap, it's it normally stops. That's the point where institutional traders are not getting the extra bonds. Well, that's another lesson we're going to talk about it some other time. But once we close the gap, we're likely to pull back down. Now, here are my results. Just 25 minutes into the trading session, uh, Tesla up $3,400, MRK $1,800, and I'm up over five grand in 25 minutes. And if you liked it, there's a link right here below to my trading room because all of these trades were called live in my trading room. It's a free 14-day trial and you do not need a credit card. So join me right now but please remember the trading is extremely hard and most traders do lose money if you like this video please give me a like it helps my channel and more people like you learn more and more about day trading and there's a button right here you can subscribe to my channel and hit on the bell if you want to be notified of my future uploads thank you very much for watching this video i'll see you in my next videos